Hello and welcome to the Beer Search Party. This is Sean Inman with you and Carl Strauss. To the Nines, their holiday ale for 2009. That's why the Nines and the somewhat ugly logo on the thing. I like the uh, light green uh, hops and the brown back, but boy, that Nine is ugly. I hate to tell you. Uh, so this is a 2009 holiday ale. It's a Imperial IPA, 9.9% .9 alcohol by volume, get it? Uh, it's a 99 IBUs and 9 SRM, whatever SRM is. I'll have to look that up later. But this is uh, from Carl Strauss, which is in San Diego. It was one of the first breweries in San Diego. Um, they have quite a few uh, uh, brewery restaurants around, especially in the San Diego area. There's one in Universal City in Los Angeles as well. Uh, for a while they didn't seem to be doing all that much. And then it looked like the other San Diego breweries passed them by and looks like now they're trying to uh, improve. I've had a few of their different beers. They have a Belgian brown ale called Full Suit that's out now. Uh, and the Double Tower IPA is much improved, I would have to say. So, let's try their holiday one. Let's see what this looks like. So, a little bit of carbonation there. Uh, orangish, orangish gold. Fairly light, pretty clear, not hazy or anything like that. So let's take a sniff of to the nines. Okay, definitely the piney aroma, the tree hop thing. Really bitter at the first first hit. I thought it was going to be malty. There was some malt flavors going up my nose as I put brought it up to my lips, and uh, but then the bitterness hit, and now it's fading off. Hmm. There's a little bit of bitterness lingering at the top of the roof of the mouth, but that's really about it. It's not heading all the way down. Hmm. There's definite... Yeah, you get that hot bitterness, then you get a bit of an alcohol burn, and then it just sort of hits a wall and stops. Uh, it's still there. Um, interesting. This is like an alcoholic IPA. I wouldn't really call it an imperial IPA. I, mean, I guess because of the volume that that's why they're calling it the imperial, but when I think of double or imperial I think more hops or more this as opposed to just alcohol. There's more malt added just to give the backbone so it just doesn't go completely haywire. And that corresponds, with a, in my mind, to a raise in the alcohol. But this just, yeah, it's like a IPA with a alcohol kick to it. Not a double to me. But if that's your sort of thing then definitely try out to the nines and just rip the label off and look at it. Uh, I would probably recommend the uh, Tower IPA instead, or if you happen to be in the San Diego area, the Los Angeles area, and you happen to be at their brew pub, try one of their special IPAs. They occasionally have one, especially on Cask Thursdays when they have special casks set up. Um, those seem to be better than this one. This one just doesn't quite do it for me. Not bad, though. It's not going to go to waste. It's not a drain pour, that's for sure. But not one of my favorite Carl Strausses uh, of, the, of their recent resurgence, that's for sure. So this is Sean, Beer Search Party. Uh, go to www.beersearchparty.com. You will get uh, news on new beers, uh, breweries from around the country and around the world. Uh, you'll get reviews like this. Uh, you'll see my 50 states, 50 beers challenge that I set for myself for the year. So feel free to check out that website and give me your comments. I'd love to hear from you, and if 
you've had this and you like it or you hate it, let me know. Thanks very much for watching and have a pleasant day. Cheers.